Aisha, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So today's video is gonna be a vlog of me going to Pangkor. So I hope you guys enjoy. Please subscribe and let's start with the video. I'm on my way to Pangkor. It takes me one hour or something. And before we go into to the Pangkor, I'm going to show you guys the Cavi Castle, which is very haunted, which you can search on the internet. Yeah, that's the one. But I never go in there, so come on the if I should. And this is me showing my makeup, which is very nice. And continue with the trip, this is the whole trip. And this is my rooftop of the car. It's, it's cloudy, it looks like it's gonna rain, and that's the place that we're going to pop. Later in the void. And this is the trip that we need to buy the package before going there. So this is on our way to the ferry. This is how it looks like, terminal ferry. So yeah, this is how the environment looks like after COVID-19 ended. So yeah, it's not crowded, it's just less people. And we are making our way to the ferry, which, which is very nice. Like The ferry looks really super cute, it reminds me of the minions. And um, yeah. It's a very long trip and this is me showing you my outfit of the day with my hair and makeup and that's the fairy which is very unique because of its color and its shape so I'm going down to the fairy and this is how we going inside of it which is very scary because I'm afraid that it's not unbalanced so yeah and this is me sitting beside the window and there's a lot of people apparently I thought there was no people at all because it was Thursday and I thought everyone else it was okay and this is the view of, of the of the beach I don't know if I should call it a beach or a sea yeah so we are here and there's a lot of people lining up to go outside and here is our destination, that's the ferry that we just got off from. There's a lot of people behind. And here at the Pangko, there's a lot of pink van which is very unique and I don't remember this. But we ran a motorcycle, two motorcycles. Okay, so this is the famous bear in Para and we are here at the hotel. So this is our room, we have a catering, gathering, I don't know for some people here And this is our room, and this is our bed And we are going out But before that I'm going to show you guys the pool, which is very huge And we got out And you know, it's like go, go out for sexy and there's a lot of chocolates right here they are not very expensive, but yeah, and there's also ikan bilis which is very common for us to cook. And there's a lot of souvenirs. I bought clothes for here because why not? It's a souvenir. A lot of sea clothes here. You know, just the beach vibe. And again, the chocolate store. We went to another one, so here much more expensive than the other one. So yeah, but then it's it's nice. And then this is the most famous thing that looks like a Chinese place. I know. Five minutes later. And here we have the beach, which we travel. Over. So beside the beach is a hotel, and there's a dog there. So that hotel is supposed to go there, but then I don't know what happened. So we ended up staying at this the other hotel which is near to the city so yeah I think it is very nice like it's almost sunset but I'm able to capture all this before 7 p.m. so yeah that's basically it a few inches later there's a lot of chocolate store like literally this is near our hotel I was like what in the world there's like so many there's like old childhood toys here which is very memorable and then we went to eat seafood 
And this is the view at night, the beach. A few moments later. So the next day, we went on a scuba dry diving trip. So basically, basically, I'm going to ride a small boat to go to the an island and scuba diving and see fishes, which is very scary. But first, we're going to eat this okay breakfast because it's good but not too bad. So yeah, this is how the view looks like in the morning. A lot of people and we are here to the destinations and we're going to get equipment first and then get on the boat so this is my equipment and when i'm wearing that i look like a monster like literally i don't know why like look at me i look like i don't know my life is For the rest of this vlog, I'm going to show you guys a lot of this vlog because I'm going to show you guys some of the islands and rocks that is very rare in Pangkor and that's basically it and I hope you guys understand this video and enjoy it so yeah So here we have the rarest rock ever which you never see it before in any other places so yeah it's really rare and yeah looks very scary but I'm going to show you guys this jetty which is very old and very unique and we are off and we are going to show you guys this another place which have a rock that looks like someone is sleeping I think so yeah it's over there if I could remember but if I'm wrong I'm sorry <laughs> We are here to our destinations and yeah it's a very bumpy trip as I say and there's a lot of people scuba diving here because this is the only place that you can you know have 
your own scuba diving activity here because this place is safer and here yeah there's a lot of people and then here we have so many fishes that you can feed to and we feed, we feed these fishes with bread and the fishes here is very beautiful like there's yellow color and black and yeah super super rare that you will see it yeah as you can see there's a lot of fish and you can swim with the fish and this is like my first time to swim with a fish but I never swim with them and that's it To behind of the island because we want to you know go because that's the only place where we can go off and go scuba diving because it's the safest place because just now the place is very slippery and it's very dangerous so yeah before that i'm going to show you guys this rare rock which looks like an alligator which is very like surprisingly like I can see the face of the crocodile there. It's kind of scary, but very nice actually. So here's the other rock that I told you that's. It looks like someone is sleeping so yeah that's it so we finally made it to the back Just like so we are at the island. And yeah, it's really ugly, but yeah. I'm just here. One thing that I like about Bangkok is that the view here, the place here, is very peaceful and relaxing, and you can get away from all of your problems, which is the best place to go for vacation and this couple of vlogs and clips are me and my mom feeding the fishes and i'm sorry if the quality of the video is super shaky and not in a good condition because my dad was recording and again i don't have an editor or a cameraman i would do this youtube all by myself so sorry for that and yeah that's basically what i'm doing yeah and then here's a clip, another clip of me trying to like show you guys the fishes which I don't know if you guys can see it clearly because I didn't bring my GoPro because I'm just, I forgot to bring it so yeah So this is how the view looks like it's the best and my mom recorded me of climbing up this rock and taking pictures. Yeah it looks super weird like what what I'm doing. So after the scuba diving I got her on my my hands. So I think I got hit by a rock, I don't know, but were, thankfully it's not a seriously injured and it's time for us to go home which is very sad but I enjoy every moment of this and I hope that I can you know, come here again with my friends or family so yeah
the very scary part. So the driver says to us that we have to be to hold on tight to the boat because when we are going to stop the boat, it's going to be very bumpy and fast, and we might fall down. So yeah, it's very scary and yeah. It's funny because my parents fell down but I didn't get to cut it so sorry. And this is me riding the I don't know what to call it but it's like a swing to so like rest and the view is nice. So it's raining right now. And <laughs> yeah that's why my camera is like foggy because it's raining. But those are all the boats and this is the best location ever like literally. The water here is very calming. Like look at it. And I'm doing this for just for fun because it has an eternity later. Then we went to Koto Blanda, which I went here when I was 6 So I'm trying to go and recreate my old photo So yeah, I'm going to recreate it and go to my Instagram right now and go see that picture And by the way, this place changed a lot since I visited There's a lot of souvenir places And that castle is where I take pictures at this is so beautiful places and the fact that I'm still the place is still here after years of me growing now it's just amazing like this is the castle that I'm telling you about so that's the place that I take my picture six when I was like six and yeah and this is the new moss on water which is very nice and beautiful like literally and the okay, the nice. Meanwhile, I found Skittle, which is very big, and there's like jelly beans, closer. I uh, gotta buy that. So, welcome to my review time. So, here we have my new perfume, which is from Chris Adams, which is very nice because the perfume is in the shade of a handbag. And this is how it looks like, it smells so nice, like literally. And then I bought the jelly beans which has the flavor of ice cream. And the bean bozo which is a small one. And the big one. I bought both because I bought it from different stores. This is the view during the night time. It is very dark out here but there are so many people here. And I'm going to do my henna. In a, in a. So this is the whole process of it and I'm very satisfied with it because it's cheap and it's beautiful like shout out to this lovely mm, sister this because she is very nice and I know she you know very friendly so yeah Result is here. It's the shade of an heart. Two thousand years. So at night we have a fire show, which coincidentally we I don't know that they're going to have a fire show, but as we like sightseeing, there's a fire show. So yeah, um, there's a lot of people here. They bring their own air beans, which they're going to sit on. So this is the fire show, which. It's similar to the Lost of Tumble which I watch like very often. So this is the closer look and the, the show is quite nice, almost similar but I enjoy it. So yeah. And then the next day, so this is going to be the last day and that's the island that we we didn't went because it was raining 
But that's basically it. We are in the ferry right now. I'm so sad right now. I feel like I want to stay here for like a month or so because this place is very peaceful, very relaxing, and you can get your problems away. And yeah, I'm gonna miss this place so much. I hope that I can come here again with my friends or family, or maybe my new family, which is my own family. So yeah. Bye bye Bango and see you next time. And I love the environment here, it's the best. We are finally here after a long journey and yeah that's the end and we got ice cream before when That's it for today's video. Hey guys enjoy today's video make sure you guys like subscribe so my post notification comment down below if you guys think I should do challenges more because I haven't done it like a while now so yeah see you guys in my next one bye